hard to underestimate how important protecting your IP is. I made an early mistake of not registering my trademark effectively. That resulted in a court case which nearly put me out of business after I'd been trading for three years. Uh, when I started my company, I was undercapitalized. I had to do my own research. I did all my company registration myself. I couldn't afford to employ professionals. In those days, I had to go to companies' house and do the research myself. I went to the British Library. Nowadays, you have it all available online to you. And it's madness not to do your research carefully. You're investing in a brand, possibly for the next 10, 20, 30 years of your life. And protecting that IP from the start is possible without too much expense. Of course, it's good to get a professional to check what you're doing, but you can do a lot of the research yourself. As the company grows and you can afford a firm of IP lawyers to be keeping an eye out for you, then I feel it's worth putting the money into that. If someone were to copy us, and of course it has happened over the years, then we will, in the first instance, write to them a sensible letter asking them to stop doing it, to withdraw their product. And generally, once it's been pointed out to them, they comply. If failure to comply could result in an expensive court case. The fact is that now the company's grown to a reasonable level, we have benefited hugely from the fact that we have quite a distinctive name and a distinctive trademark. Um, we are entering new markets at the moment. We currently sell in about 50 countries across the world. We're selling particularly well in Europe and of course we've protected our IP there. In America, that's uh, going through at the moment and we're looking at several Far Eastern uh, countries. Protecting our IP means that we can legally trade without the worry of copycat companies passing off as Jojo and possibly producing substandard product which in effect will reflect badly on us, the parent company, the original company. So I think that having a good trademark, having a distinctive brand is vital if you're looking at the global market in the future.